I'm James Monroe, and I founded Alvar because I believe that this brand new technology can revolutionize the way engineers design around thermal expansion. And it's been really cool because I get to actually test and see firsthand this negative thermal expansion property, never before seen in any other material out there. This stuff is truly revolutionary. Design engineers, product engineers, when we tell them about our material, their first reaction is no way. And when we show it to them, we prove it to them, they say, oh my, this is interesting. And then there's silence. <laughs> and you can see the wheels turn. That's when you know you're on to something. I have worked with uh, all different types of metals over the last 25 plus years, primarily in the precision machining industry. So when I encountered something that would change the, uh, the thermal dynamics of material, I was extremely excited. My name is Jeremy McAllister. I am responsible for producing and testing these first of a kind negative thermal expansion alloys. So in the past couple of years, uh, we've really come a long ways. We've gone from this test picture to uh, really a state-of-the-art dilatometer that can very accurately measure the CTE of our material. On the manufacturing side, we've grown the scale that we can actually produce. We're able to manufacture a thicker plate rod, tube, uh, all capabilities that didn't exist when I joined the company. Uh, my name is Jay Zagarba. I joined Allvar uh, in February of last year. Uh, on the marketing side, I'm identifying target markets and uh, developing strategies uh, to attack those markets. Our first challenge was really to grasp uh, uh, what our metal was able to accomplish, uh, and possibly completely revolutionizing the way some industries attack thermal expansion problems. We knew there would be doubters, uh, so our first task was to establish a quality program uh, and uh, that solidifies our processes. Uh, we document uh, everything. We have complete material traceability. And we, we look like a material manufacturer. At the beginning, it's important to focus on um, on the financial aspect and what you can do with those finances in order to achieve what the customers are wanting. And there's you have to look at a lot of different opportunities and using capital wisely and and resourcefully is very important. I'm David Content. I've been working at Alvar since uh, October of 2016. My, my role has been to guide the Alvar team in managing the operational objectives based on customer feedback. We are not the same company we were a year ago. Uh, we've been able to acquire process equipment, uh, testing equipment, uh, and all of this being in-house has enabled us to make further advancements in our technology and in fact we have come up with our first alloy, alloy 16. Uh, we have another one that's not far behind. 